change image size in PrestaShop 1.7 so you might have this problem like this I'll just demonstrate what are the problems okay so the image size is very big and uh, you have uploaded a small image size and that is like a big problem so how to solve this thing is very easy so first of all let's just see what exactly the problem we have so in the last video we have built this so if you guys uh, didn't watch that video I'll provide you the link in the description so that you can check this video and uh, how we have set up all those things so let's just uh, quickly jump over so here is the first problem if you can see the image is actually horizontal and the uh, whatever the container is coming up is uh, completely uh, vertical so this is the big problem so how do we solve this we have to define the image size okay so let's go into the admin panel slash admin one two three but yes make sure that once we change the image sizes configuration after that you have to re-upload all the images then only it will work otherwise it will not gonna work okay so let's log in and yeah okay so first of all we have to go into the design and uh, here you can see image settings and now you have to figure out what exactly this image size is so in order to figure out we have to just go into the inspect element and check out what exactly the uh, what you can say URL of this image okay so let's just quickly open this and you can see here home underscore default so here here is a setting for that particular image uh, yeah here you can see 270 by 360 and it is only available to the product not to the category not to the uh, stores and anything like that so first of all we have to change this particular thing so let's just edit and we have to create a squared image okay at least uh, upper and lower uh, what you can say white spaces will go off so 7 270 and save okay so this is done and uh, let's just check what we get actually we will not gonna see the differences yet we have to upload a new image of all the products okay so then only it will gonna show you the changes so here you can see these are all pre-built images when we upload a product into the Presto shop so it will not gonna create those images on the fly so that is one problem you can say or one nice thing about PrestaShop but this is it you have to re-upload all the images once you're done okay now in this particular uh, here if you can see the same images you used I guess uh, what is that no, no medium default okay so for the medium default also we need to change the where is that here is 360 so just go into this and change it to 270 or whatever the size which you required okay 270 and save okay so this is nice now i'll just demonstrate this with uh, adding a new product so for that i need some images so i'll do one thing i'll just download these images as it is save image and where should I save this on the desktop itself it will be better okay save and again let's just call, download these three images and we'll see this come on man what happened it is not changing okay so let's just go to the catalog and add new product that way we can see the difference in the new product okay yeah it has loaded so save this image and yep and also our product page is also open 
so we can create a new product okay let's give this a name demo image setting and add those two products which we have you know images we have downloaded okay perfect now you can just save this and i would like to add it into the category if required so that we can see the changes into the category page save yeah and you can first of all take a look to the product detail page and uh, let's confirm that those image size has actually changed okay yo so we got this square and we got this square perfect now let's just go into the sofa category page and let's see do we have this particular product properly aligned okay so yo see perfect we are getting this in a squared image so that's it this is a very simple process to do but after doing this thing you need to make sure that you will going to change all those images that is the most important thing otherwise this effect will not gonna show up so if you like this video please like and subscribe to my channel for all latest up technical updates and uh, videos something like this and thank you for watching